I recently visited Kennedy's Orbiter Processing Facility to find out how a highly skilled team of shuttle technicians spent the past few months preparing Endeavour for STS-126. I'm here inside the Orbiter Processing Facility with Ken Tenbush, NASA Flow Director here at the Kennedy Space Center. Hey, Dan. Ken, nice to see you today. Nice to meet Ken, you. Ken, can you tell us what exactly is shuttle flow? Shuttle flow is taking that vehicle from the time that it is landed, it's rolled over here to the Orbiter Processing Facility and all the processing here, along with the external tank processing that's happening at the same time over in the vehicle assembly building, and then the solid rocket booster processing that's going on as well, the stacking and getting that all ready and checked out, and then bringing all of those components together. Vehicle assembly building, and then the solid rocket booster processing that's going on as well. rocket booster processing that's going on as well, the stacking and getting that all ready and checked out, and then bringing all of those components together in one overall integrated shuttle vehicle. And then once you're at that point, you do a, a checkout in the vehicle assembly ability, roll that out to the pad, do all the checkout there, load the vehicle, get it ready for flight, and then you're basically a processing flow from start to finish, from that landing all the way on through to launch.